Hi people with the spirit of learning, thank you very much for coming back to my youtube channel Well, my name is Angga Rizky and now we're gonna learn about how to design and code for the React Native for the iOS development Well, in this case, we're gonna design the splash skin with the sun illustration and the button click to action And I have provided those assets in the video's description so you have to download it and follow my video in this tutorial Okay, everyone with the spirit of learning, let's get started so everyone with the spirit of learning, welcome back to my video and this is that we're gonna try to implement in the react native for the iOS okay so in this case I'm not going to rush to finish all of them but I'm gonna try by in this design just focus on this section the get started all right well basically I have provided the assets uh, in the video's description and then i put in the my directory uh anga react and then src and sets and then there's the illustration okay very cool all right so the thing that we have to do this is uh, you have to install your own react and i'm using the native base for the button okay and then don't forget to import image text and view right cool and here let's get started with the uh, this one image view okay so here I will try to use image like this then you have to put source with the require and this is uh, means that we have to go out from the login once time and then the second time and then heading to the assets over here and then a uh, name of the file we can go with the uh, wait let me rename this uh, EMG splash okay EMG splash okay so here supposed to be EMG splash.png all right so we're gonna save it and I'm going to uh, open it in the simulator because in this case I'm using the uh, yarn yarn uh, yarn yarn sorry yarn run iOS just like this okay or you can also uh, just using the npm react native uh, Re sorry react native run ios okay it doesn't matter so i'm using the you know uh, hot reloading like this but just reload like this and there's a image okay amazing and then i want to give a style over here just just give the style and then styles emg splash okay and then we're heading to the style.js and i will give the emg splash here okay and yeah if we check in the design uh, size of the illustration is supposed to be about uh, 294 okay so here 294 for the hake supposed to be around it like this okay and then we could see into the emulator and it's supposed to be like this amazing but i'm going to make it more more bigger just pretend that we go with a 290 here just like this and this is supposed to be 300 okay amazing and then i just want to give the uh, margin left about 20 if we see no I think we have to increase by uh, 30 and then if we see in the margin top just go ahead with the uh, 70 okay all right amazing I think 70 is that too far so just go with a 40 okay amazing yeah and margin left I will decrease again for the 25 well actually that you're able to use the flex box but in this case i'm not going to use the flex box all right so just use the margin and everything let's continue to the another section so we got this one we can copy discover new home today okay so we have to use a text here and then use text and I will change it to the GSX okay alright so here's like this 
discover new home today so over here i will give a brick line like this and you just need to copy and like this okay and we're gonna check into the simulator and you got like this amazing and i will give the style over here just like usually maybe uh title splash okay and then uh, we put here title splash like this so for the text align is supposed to be to the center right and then for the font size supposed to be bigger just go with 32 okay and then let's see first all right amazing and i want to give the land height for the spacing maybe just go with the 20 ah uh, no supposed to be bigger 42 uh 62 ah uh, no just go with the uh 45 okay and after that we give the margin top about 20 all right amazing now we just want to change the color so the color code is we take a look from here and then put over here okay and we tada amazing and right now we want to try to make the button for the click to action so button like this and then button okay and we provide another text here okay just like this and then this one supposed to be take me in right and then we're gonna check over here all right like this as i said that i'm using the native base you could use just like this transparent okay and then boom we got the uh, no background but if you want to just keep like this there's a background right but we could also just give them the style which is we don't use the native base so styles btn uh, tag okay and then we're going to here btn tag like this and then for width just go with uh, this one about 240 and height just go with a 45 and then uh, border radius supposed to be 200 like this okay and just uh, use the background color red sorry just for the dummy okay amazing right and we want to give the margin top about 30 and then margin left about uh, 30 okay like this but i think that it's not center yet so for the margin left just increase with the 50 ah uh, no 45 okay amazing and then for the text itself uh, are we able just use you know text align center here no it's not gonna happen because that i think we have to give style to this okay styles which is uh text button okay so in the text button we have to give the color fff fff and then the font size about mm, let's take a look here oh so the font size is 18 okay like this amazing and just with the uh, go with the font wake bolt okay oh you have to use a double code i really forget
okay and uh, if you see here the label is still in the left so I think you have to give text align center and then give the uh, width same like the btn tag okay so then after that you see that the text in the center amazing so for the button i think that i'm not able to make it a gradient like the way i do in the css or website design so we have to use library but in this case we got two case we will use the image or we will use only solid color okay so this is for the button right and just copy this hex code and you will get the green one like this but we could also just give them the image which is uh, over here in the button we provide the image here okay so i'm going to copy this one and then we don't have to use style just change it to the uh, background button splash okay and then uh, in the style sorry just give the uh, position absolute and then z index minus 20 and don't forget to use a double quote here okay and you see there's a background amazing right so over here just change none okay and we'll try again and boom cool right I wanna give the little function if we click this button there's an alert okay so over here we get like a say hello just like this okay and then here supposed to be alert sorry hello just like this and then here we give on press like this and this say hello okay let me try first and what's the problem is um, fail it to bundle okay so to define the function you have to put candle like this and then hello hello okay so button press it. okay so this one okay but maybe in the next time we're gonna try to design another screen which is when we click this it goes to the another screen all right so thank you very much okay everyone with the spirit of name i hope it was amazing for you and please let me know if you do have some feedback a question or anything else just let me know in the videos comment well if you found this video was useful for you please hit that subscribe button and share with your friends with your colleagues and with your co-workers and right now i have to go and i'll see you in the next video bye